and welcome to Boxing Evolution TV. My name is Monica Harris and I am here in Walking at the Police Community Centre where I'm going to be interviewing future prospect Dan Williams. So let's go inside and have a chat with Dan now. Dan, how are you doing today? I'm doing all right. Very well. Now, Dan's just won the UK um, Junior Golden Gloves Championship, is that right? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Uh, talk me through that. Uh, well, the semi-finals was in Kent, wasn't it? Yep. Yeah, in Kent. And that lasted about one minute, 20 seconds. And he got a cut down there on his eye, so the doctor stopped it. Uh, and then the finals in Yorkshire. That was against Idris Hussein, I think his name was. And I stopped him in the second round with a left hook. Fantastic. Do you tend to find that most of your fights result in a stoppage before the end of the, the fight? Uh, most of them have, yeah. I've had 11 fights, nine wins and eight stops. That's some record. Let's just remind everybody how old you are again. Well, I'm only 17. That's fantastic. Your parents must be very proud. Yeah, yeah, they are. <laughs> Always beyond me. Okay, so you won, you won the Golden Gloves. Yeah. What's next for you, do you think? I'm going to try and get in the GB development squad. If I can't do that, then I'll just keep training. <laughs> what do you think you would have been doing had you not have taken up boxing at such a young age? Some sort of fighting, like kickboxing, MMA, something like that. But do you think that boxing or any sort of discipline like that is a good thing for young people to get into to sort of keep them from hanging around the streets or getting into trouble or anything like that? Yeah, I've always, I've, that's why I like doing it because it gives me something to do really. But I like doing an indiv individual sport. I, I didn't really like football that much because I had to rely on other people. But this is me and only me, so. Mm. Yeah. So at what age did you realise that you had a talent for boxing? Not sure really. Started at the age of twelve, and I just kept going training, three times a week, all the whole time. That was it. Didn't really realise <laughs> until you started knocking people out. Yeah. <laughs> so um, you started boxing at the age of twelve. What got you into boxing that young? I'm not sure really. Uh, I was talking to my dad, and uh, I used to play football. And then I said I wanted to do an individual sport, and he said, "How about tennis?" I said, "No." Nah. He said, "How about boxing?" I was like, "I'll try that." So I tried it and I loved it. <laughs> it is very addictive, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> so what can you see for yourself in the future? Like, what is your ultimate goal, do you think? World champion. That's it, really. <laughs> we'll settle for nothing less, Dan. Nothing less, no. <laughs> Brilliant. And you sat next to your coach here. How are you doing, coach? I'm good, thanks. So tell me about his progress at the time that he's been uh, under your supervision at this gym. Yeah, he's progressed well. Um, Dan's been with the club. Um, this is his second full season boxing, isn't it? Um, he's had all his bouts with us, slowly progressing. We've got uh, two national titles. He's just been out to France boxing for England. So the uh, future looks good. Fantastic. Well, I wish you all the very best for this. It's been nice to have you on Boxing Evolution TV. You've been watching me, Monica Harris, and I'll see you all again very soon.